Hey guys, so I made a ramen video a few years ago, but this time I want to put more effort and time into making it better. Ramen is one of the most popular Japanese fast foods, although it's not fast to cook. This recipe took me two days to make, but it was definitely worth it. It's probably hard to get all the ingredients I used for this recipe if you're not living in Japan, but you can easily make some of the delicious toppings I made, so please give it a try. Alright, let's start cooking. Let's make toppings first. I'm going to start with pork. Rub in salt to season. Then slowly sear the outside of the pork. Now let's make the sauce for the pork and boiled eggs. Get the green part of the green onion, a few slices of ginger, and crush the garlic. Add sake, mirin, soy sauce, sugar, salt in a pot, and heat it up on low heat. Turn off the burner before it boils. Now, wrap the pork with a paper towel and put everything in a Ziploc bag. Then, get rid of the air inside the bag. Using a bowl of water makes this process easy. Then, place it in a rice cooker and add boiled water. Press the keep warm button and it'll be done cooking in about 3 to 4 hours. Then, keep it in a fridge for half a day. Now let's make half boiled eggs. Making a tiny hole at the bottom of the eggs prevents it from cracking. Boil the eggs for 6 minutes and a half. Take the eggs out and cool them down. When they are cooled down, get rid of the shells. If you have a container like this, put the egg in, cover them with water, and shake it. Place the eggs in Tupperware and add equal parts water and sauce. Then cover it with a paper towel and keep it in the fridge for half a day as well. When the pork is done, slice it as thin or as thick as you want. Now let's make the soup. Prepare the soup stock like this. Next, add a green onion, ginger slices, chicken bones and wings in boiled water and boil them for a minute to get rid of the smell. Place them in cold water and chop the bones into chunks. Put the bones and chicken wings in a pot and cook it on very low heat for an hour. Let's make clam soup at the same time. Before cooking the clams, get rid of sand in the clams by adding 3% salt water and wait for half a day. Boil the clams with sake and kondu for 30 minutes on low heat. Skim off scum while boiling. Cut off the skin of chicken and fry it on low heat until it becomes crispy. I'll use chicken oil for the soup and chicken skin for the topping later. Let's make another topping. This time I'll use the white part of green onion. Cut off the core 
and slice it thinly. Soak it in water for 5 minutes. Now let's blend all the soup. The blend ratio is completely up to you. For example, if you want the soup to be a little more fishy, then add more bonita stock. You can see my ratio in the description box, but you can adjust however you want and make your own soup. When the soup is done, add soy sauce with kombu and chicken oil and ramen bowl first. Let's prepare toppings. Scorch the pork slices. Cut the egg in half. Pour soup in the bowl. Finally, boil the noodle. Strain it well. And finish.